So you passed the FAA Part 107 exam. First off, congrats, that's an awesome accomplishment. But before you start flying commercially, there's one more important step. You need to apply for your remote pilot certificate through the FAA's IACRA system so you can legally fly under Part 107. Let me show you how to do it. Hey everyone, this is Adam from UAV Coach, a leading drone education company. Now, let's clear something up. The FAA doesn't automatically send you your certificate just because you passed the test. You still need to apply for it. And during that process, the TSA runs a background check to confirm you're eligible to be a remote pilot. And a quick heads up before we jump in, in our experience, the IACRA website doesn't work great with Safari. So we'd recommend you use Chrome, Firefox, or even Internet Explorer. First, log back into your IACRA account. From the applicant console, click Start New Application. When it asks for the application type, select Pilot. Then under Certifications, choose Remote Pilot Initial and click Start Application. Now you'll be taken to the application process. The first section, which is personal information, will already be filled out based on what you entered when you registered. Take a quick look to confirm it's accurate, then hit save and continue. Next, you'll answer two questions, one about English language proficiency and one about drug convictions. If there's anything you want to add, there's a space for comments. When you're ready, click save and continue. Now, you'll provide the details from your government issued photo ID, the same one you used at the testing center. Then enter your knowledge test ID from the score sheet the proctor gave you. Just a note, it can take up to 72 hours after passing for your test results to show up in IACRA. Once you've got all of that, hit save and continue again. Now it's time to review and submit your application. You'll be asked if you've ever been denied a certificate before, so answer that and then scroll down. You'll need to open and view three documents, the Pilot's Bill of Rights, the Privacy Act, and your full application. After reviewing those, you'll sign the acknowledgement and electronically sign your application. Once that's done, your application is automatically sent to the FAA's Airman Registry. You're almost there, I promise. In about seven days, your temporary remote pilot certificate will be available in your IACRA account. You'll also get an email letting you know it's ready, so be on the lookout for that. Once you've got the temporary certificate, you're officially cleared to start flying under Part 107. Print it out and keep it with you anytime you fly. Finally, your permanent certificate, which is the actual card, will arrive in the mail within six to eight weeks. And that's it. You're now a certified remote pilot. Let us know in the comments if you've gone through this process before and if you have any other questions about this process. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. Until next time, blue skies and safe flying.